Today we thought we'd talk about our Nordland axe. It's a piece that's near and dear to our hearts. We kind of like axes a lot at Arms and Armory, as you can tell. And this particular one is one that's very popular for us at events and shows where people can come in and they are looking for something they want to take home as a memento or looking for an actual tool to use out camping or something. So a lot of people will pick up the Nordland axe. It's named after a region in Norway as you start to go to the northern part of the country. It was found in an archeological dig. So it's a very early style. It's something you don't uh, necessarily want to put and say, well, you know, this is medieval. Though, when you look at the style and shape of the head, you see this very ax through that entire period of time. From when it was originally deposited there, you still see this type of ax being used into the Middle Ages and even late Middle Ages. It is a type C head style. That entails a flatter top to it, a fairly straight cutting edge, and a long hanging beard down in the uh, structure of the head. As I said, this is a very popular style seen across Europe and uh, particularly was favored in Northern Norway and Sweden uh, early on. Our halves are designed specifically for this axe. We have them turned by a spoke maker. They are made out of hickory, so they are very strong and durable. They are socket fitted, so it comes up from the base. So this portion of the haft is actually larger than the socket itself. So it's almost impossible for it to come off without some kind of catastrophic wood failure at the top. They are very efficient tools. This style of ax could have been used as a farming implement, uh, on the hunt, out in the field. Uh, it is a weapon. It could be used in combat or in a voyage of discovery. A uh, Viking on ship could easily have used this to do carving, uh, cut lines, uh, have battle against someone else uh, as a raiding tool. All those things are uh, very feasible with this type of style of tool. Uh, this particular axe is one that we like a lot. We use them for throwing sometimes. Uh, many of us have them at home and use them every day as tools. Uh, I just recently got uh, an email from somebody where they had sent me a picture of theirs and they had used it to trim their Christmas tree. So it is a very efficient tool. And if you're looking to add an axe or two to your uh, collection, this would be a great one to do.